Hello folks, this is the Liverpool Echo uh, news. So a barber has tried to bring a million pounds worth of cocaine to Liverpool for 500 quid. They found, the police found 10 kilograms of cocaine hidden in secret panels after he drove his Ford on the M62. So that's the paper chaser there. And he's a he owns two barber shops in a town called Bolton. So um, the reason I'm putting the video up is you've got to see the comments. The comment sections are gold in these stories. Now we've had many a um, conspicuous MP running our city. The mayor has been arrested, although he's released on bail now. They've got a new mayor. Well, we've got three mayors, actually. The Lord Mayor, the City Mayor, and the Regional Mayor. And it was the City Mayor who was arrested. But Liverpool is like... They're trying to turn it into Las Vegas because... Well, it, you can look it up in, in yourself, but... It's just bars, hotels, nightclubs, casinos... Because all the students come here now, they've opened up three universities. So, his name was Patel. And Patel is not an English name. Um, anyway, well, it's Indian, but that means, you know, nothing. But the saying, he's of good character, never been in trouble before. So let's have a look at these comments. Because he's got six years for this. And he's admitted supplying cocaine. Which he hasn't actually supplied. Because, well, you don't know how long he's been doing it, I suppose. So he says, um, this fella, he's probably been bang at it for years. The rat should got 20 plus, 20 years plus. So then the next one has said, poor man, I wonder what pressure overwhelmed him. Well, he's obviously a user, isn't he? You know, 500 quid, I'll do that. But the thing is, he's like, he's been one of these imports by, um, oh, what's her name? Barbara Spector Lerner has said, Jews will be resented for their leading role in, you know, destroying the, um, the demograph of Europe. So he's one of the reasons why the Jews are resented because this is what they're doing. These biological weapons, they're coming in and they're transporting goods all over the place. Well, drugs. So um, better off a co sugar-coated story. 10 kilos for five ton. Clever lad. So 10 kilos for 500 pounds is not really warranted this guy's saying um because he's a barber he'll have a lot of work in walton just to get paid in pot noodles and spice spice is this mad drug that's oh, really harsh he, he doesn't look like a scott looks more like a fabio someone said bye bye and then someone said he's in even more financial debt now he owes someone one million quid so all that hair must must have got his head going for that 500 quid. Looks like he necked off of it before he got stopped. It's a snip at that price. No sympathy, but still a bit, um, still a bit back to front. How he's got six years and all these other low lives are getting off that for stabbing and maiming people. And then someone says, yeah, that's a good shout. So it says, um, what stamp was on them? I guess that must be on the, uh, the bags or whatever. Um, then someone says, the silver handcuff ones. Why didn't the police just follow them and get more people? <laughs> what a question. Why didn't they do that? Yes, well, the police know why. Uh, someone said, oh, he's gorgeous. 
and someone said that's embarrassing and there's 25 comments like it's such an obvious ploy to downplay his role in this operation how much money was laundered through the two shops as for the sent sentence this is no deterrent or there is no deterrent let's have it right he hasn't been trusted with 10 boxes of coke on a one-off so the saying he's been doing it a lot and then someone's saying yeah that's what i'm saying lad so that's 33 pound 35 every year in the jug so 33 pound what is it 500 quid 50 quid per kilo um he was stopped because the police thought he was vincent from beauty and the beast it's funny that people think he the rosas the police were lucky to stop him on the off chance when we all know he'll have been under surveillance for months well the police run the drugs so they know exactly who's got what expensive short back and sides that one no sympathy he was involved in peddling misery he is the spit of one of my cats <laughs> and that's it okay folks